How's it going, everybody? It's your boy, Walkie Talk Games here, bringing you another episode of The Walking Dead. And last episode, we had gotten separated from Chuck and got trapped in a house because of the walkers. So without further ado, you guys, let's get started. All right, gonna go up to the attic and check on Kenny. I don't know why Ben is so worried on what's going on up here. It's kind of giving this a creepy scene going on. Kenny? You all good, Kenny? Why you just kneel down there, man? You look like Kenny. you've seen a ghost, bro. You okay, man? Jesus, what the hell is that? Oh my god. Well, crap. This man cannot catch a break, can he? He loses his wife and kid, and now he sees another zombified kid. This man can't catch a break. Don't looks like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? I mean, no not way. really in my opinion, but I do you, I guess, since Starved you just him. lost him. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Before it was your own son. Now it's just a kid who needs your help. You can do this, Kenny. Kenny can do this. I don't know. This. I know. I just... This ain't his kid. He can redeem himself from what happened with his kid. It, that was different. This will make it clean and quick. That was his kid. I don't know that this I This is do some me. random walker. He didn't know, know him. Can. I couldn't even help my own boy. That was your own flesh and blood. No father could have done that. But yes, you sir. Help this boy. We come in clutch with the realism him. talk. Send him on his way. Quick and clean. Good job, Kenny. We should bury You him. just redeemed yourself. I'll take care of it. I feel like Lee did that a little bit on purpose. Like, let me just pick up the walker. Just look him in the eye for a second before I take him down. See, look what you did. You just made my, that man feel even more like crap. Honestly, though, I hope Clementine doesn't see this. She doesn't need to see this. It is kind of sad to see this kid. I feel like he died of starvation. I mean, he's really skinny. At least he's going in the grave with, I assume it's his dog. Could be the, it could have been the family dog. I guess that was his moment of silence for the the kid. I mean, he doesn't really have anything to say. He doesn't. They don't know him. This is just a really crappy situation everybody got put in. The least I could do is just bury him. I feel like he's imagining this being Clementine, not in the sense of. Like, seeing her die him, not protecting her, as more of, he could have seen this happening to her now, if he never found her. Or this could have happened if 
he been with her. He doesn't know. He honestly doesn't know what he should do with her besides love her and protect her. I mean, they don't really got a whole lot of <clears throat> answers to this. Well, that's not creepy, bro. Like... Hey! Hey! You like stalking people? You come back here, I'll kill you! You understand? I'll kill you! Lee, what's going on? There was a creeper around the corner. I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No. Too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted them. Was it a man or a woman? Like that that's kind of sketched. What does it matter? At this point we need to the same get out of here. Following us. The guy on the this radio. guy knows where we're at, and I feel like that may have been the dude on the walkie-talkie warning us Maybe. about the walkers. I'm fine. I just I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves. Kimmy's right. I really don't feel comfortable don't here if that guy knows exactly where well, we are. You better we get need ready dip. because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well, then, hell, what are we waiting Honestly, for? Honestly, this is not a good stop. situation we're no. in. Ben, you'll only slow us down. Lee and I can go scout. Honestly, the I agree with Kenny. You You've done out. nothing you for us. All you Wait, have done is complain, come? run no, away, no, and left Clementine to die. To the I'm the still river. honestly kind of annoyed with you by that. We need to focus on finding a boat right now, Clem. Like we talked about on the train, remember? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Like, bro. Let's see if Omid needs anything. I don't want to lie to Clem, but so at the same time, we gotta here? get out of here. Well, I mean, uh, well, you see, kind of, yeah. That's not how it is, Ben. Yeah, I don't like you right now. Keep an eye on Clementine. You. I can do that. Left so Clementine to die. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. But can Did you, you even shoot or listen? Anything or anyone. Good. You act like I'm being hard by saying kill anyone, but we got a guy who knows stuff about us that we don't know. He just watched us at the gate. He clearly has been following us this whole time. I personally don't trust the dude enough to not let him live. I'm sorry. I'd rather him honestly be dead. This dude's gone completely nuts in the head. Honestly. Why are you looking in the car? There's nothing in a... Like, that car has literally been picked apart. I don't doubt there's nothing in the engine either. I bet they cleaned that out too, whoever did that. And this man's on a war path, just full of rage. And I'm back here thinking, well, crap. This man's on the verge of snapping, I feel like. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? I've wanted to say keep an eye out for Chuck, right but yeah. I need no. Kenny to feel like Should I have his back the right now. Right up ahead. But I feel like that made him kind of angry. That bastard's I don't know. He's with us again. It's another trap. He's no, on listen, edge. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. What in the hell is going on? I don't know, but they're not coming towards us. 
I mean, they could be distracting them. Hmm. I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. I mean, I whatever feel like man. they're doing us a I favor. Find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their mother. Because they're distracting the walkers away from Good us, one. but I can't guarantee it. Hmm. Let's keep moving. I don't know. What do you guys think? I personally don't think we should trust anything that's going on in this city Still right now. Moving behind us. Everything in this city is just a little too sketchy. Oh my god. Well, crap. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. I really don't think so, man. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan, Lee. This is our best and only shot. You said so yourself back at the house. You agreed with me. Yeah, but that was before we... I think that just made him even more angry. I probably should have kept quiet. <clears throat> I don't know. I don't think right now I should talk to him. I think he's just... On the verge of snapping and is really wanting this boat thing to work out. This one I might don't know if this is going to work out, though. I'm just going to choose to be quiet. I'm just going to choose to be quiet. I don't want to piss him off even more. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. I mean, that's the best bet we got. I'll just leave Kenny to his thoughts. Let's go check out this waterfront, see if there's anything we can find. I highly doubt it though, this place looks like it's Great. been rummaged clean. It's a quarter to work. Great. Well, I guess we could ask Larry. <laughs> that man has some change in his back pocket. Oh, well, that's not so creepy. Bro. <laughs> Is this meant to be what the hell? Warning? Don't do something like this. I am not gonna even wonder what the hell happened. <clears throat> That's uh okay. Gotta find change. Cash register. I highly <laughs> I'm gonna go check the cash register. I highly doubt there's anything in there, but I mean, you never know. It's the end of the world. Yeah, yeah I figured. Kind of figured. It's all good. Maybe the newspaper machine? I don't know. I, I just really don't want to ask Kenny. I, this man's, wow. like, really lost it right now. It wouldn't let me... It wouldn't let me, like, move my analog stick uh, cursor over anything. Well, at least we got a quarter. So now we can go use the telescope. I don't know. I just feel like this is really gonna end badly. I don't know. We haven't had the best of luck these past couple of weeks. We've been attacked by bandits. What's we lost Kacha boat? and Duck. It ain't gonna work. This man snapped. Holes beneath the water line. Well, someone stripped out the back. And now we got a crazy you man following it. us and knowing who we are. Oh, you like the wall? Yeah, what the, I found it about what two minutes that? ago. A fate worse than death. So while you admire that, I'm going to go check the water from. Well, nothing. Of any boots down there. Kinda figured. This place is completely Abandoned, deserted. Like every other place in the city. There's nothing. And whatever it is is all sunk and what Who are you? What the hell? I'll give you that. You got some moves, but I don't know how that's possible. You're handing out nothing on that. Oh, there could be a handheld. 
The building could have deteriorated enough there's handhelds, but I don't know. That's still pretty impressive though. Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? It could be our bell ringer. Sounds like a plan. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet. This Take man looks so surprise. proud of that idea. Like, <laughs> like it's a great a idea. I mean, it's not a bad idea. I'll, I'll give it to him on that, top. but... I, mean, I haven't really seen Kenny fight. All I've seen this man do is get shot in the gut and overpowered. I don't know. I feel like it could be a good fighter if it's put up to it, but... Wait, where did you go? Where'd you go? You're not there anymore. What the? Wait, what? Oh, hell no. Well, it sucks to be you, don't it? Lee? How'd you... Clem? Where'd you come from? Oh, I am gonna kill Ben, bro. This man did not do his job. I simply I'm asked Ben to Crawford. keep an eye on her. What's Crawford? Have you been following us? Following you? Mind if I get up? Slowly. Eh, I really don't want you to get up. I feel like you might attack again. I don't know. I don't really trust you. Kenny, don't! What, Kenny! Again no, with getting us. put on your ass? I hope you did a lot better at fighting before the world ended. Who the hell are you people? Oh, you know, we're just tourists coming to enjoy the views, the sightseeing. The name's Molly. Molly, I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No, but I'm not going to tell you my life story. Everything so I'm just going to tell you, I don't know what Crawford is. What the hell happened to you? You sure you want to know? When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't... Or can't live by their rules. I so how'd you know assuming we they then? killed everybody. I feel like that's what they did. I feel like that's because what she's no meaning. Because she's really surprised to see a child. But so was Omi, so. Was that you at our house this morning? Watching me through the I'm going to go ahead and ask the most important no. questions. On Believe it or not, I've got better things to do She's following us, because I need to narrow down what the hell's going on. <laughs> Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. Oh, great. I knew it. Lee, I knew she was the one who's been following us. Fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. Well, I highly you. doubt I don't even know who the hell you Lee would let that happen, but down, I highly doubt Kenny would be able to stop Remember? it. <laughs> yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raised the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks. I mean, the bells the is smart, the but I really don't appreciate she almost got us killed. Yeah, you know, like at the carnival, they'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart. Uh, well, I heard weirder Doesn't names take much for walkers. Outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. You're not wrong. Now, why are you here? How'd you get out of the house? Well, Meat started getting really sick. Krista and Ben had to take him upstairs. 
I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. Yeah. I mean, I love your optimism, Clementine. But realistically, right now, you really can't help. No I mean, you don't know how to survive. You don't really know what we're looking for. You're only caring about your parents at this point instead of survival. And you don't know medical care. That's how they survive. So, yeah, not Jesus trying to be rude, but Just the opposite you can't help. Think about it. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually, I mean, I mean kids? No. I mean, I wasn't going to ask that. I kind of already figured the answer, but. Left them to fend for themselves out here in the world. Like I said, I mean, zero I, tolerance. you can go ahead and ask that all you want, can you? Know, by all means. Hold their own weight. The way they looked at it, those people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed, a drain on their precious resources. How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. That's crazy, honestly. I can't believe that entire town of Crawford picked everything. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing? I mean, it is survival of the fittest to an extent. We're just trying to survive, same as you. And but the not only way we're gonna survive is by getting on a boat and getting out the children. hell out of here. Yeah, <clears throat> good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating. Great. Each other. So our boat idea is screwed. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron! You want to keep Great. your voice down? Now he's losing his shit again. Shit! Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Great. Just wait. Oh, that's all we're gonna do. Got another situation there, everybody. Can we not worry about the boat for like five Gunshot seconds? Isn't there another way back to the house? Yeah. Is there a all of this bitch? I really don't like now, Molly. Don't know, don't care. So what the hell are we supposed to do? I refer you to my previous answer. But you have to help us, please. I really don't like you. Come on, make it fast. Oh, now you decide how can she ass? Okay. Fuck me. Come on, come on, hurry. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm good. I don't want to get bitten. I don't want to get eaten. Uh, how about we hurry this up? Kenny, you are disappointing me more and more. Fantastic. I hope that this is not going to come back and bite me. Oh, great. Any bright ideas now, everybody? Of course. Here, use that to pry it open. Oh, thanks. Much appreciated. For once, that you're actually helping. Man, she can scream. Oh, crap. Okay, then. I mean, that's one way to let them die. Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Shit. Alright, everybody. That's all the time I got for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notifications bell down below. I hope you all had a good day so far. 
And with that being said, Walkie Talk Games, signing off.